and now it's time to get your diet and your body back on track with some new fitness goals. I have created a four-week program that will help accomplish this by cardio kick and Pilates drills. We are entering into the third week of the program. How the program works is that you will be given two workouts per week that build upon the previous day. You will perform the exercises in circuit format, 10 to 15 reps, one to three times through. So let's go ahead and learn the exercises for week three's workout plan. The first exercise is front kick ball change switch. You will assume a fighting stance, front kick, ball change, and then kick to the other leg. Alternate sides by doing this movement. Keep your arms up by your ears, your core in tight, and add a little hop to your step. Place one foot onto the foot bar and extend the other leg straight. Begin to do a single leg footwork while adding a front kick. Keep the toes pointed, or you can flex the foot. Press the spine into the glide board as you ride up and down the rails. Be sure to do this exercise on both sides. Place the incline to a medium or low level. Come to your foot bar and place your hands on top. Step to the glide board and bring your body into a side plank position. While tucking your knees in and out, maintain your plank position with your shoulders on top of your wrist. For advanced option, extend one leg and add a side kick. Be sure to do this exercise on both sides. With one leg, step up to the glide board and add a side kick, leading with your heel. Be sure to look at your target of where you're kicking to keep your balance. For more intensity, add your side kick and then go back into a curtsy lunge. Keep your core engaged, arms up by your ears, and be sure to do this exercise on both sides. Assume a fighting stance. You'll do a front punch, a hook punch, and then a knee strike, keeping your arms by your ears and returning to your stance each time. You can start to pick up your pace once you feel comfortable with the movement. Be sure to do this exercise on both sides. Using the cables, come into a Z-sit position for cable pulls. Keep the chest lifted, your core engaged, as you pull the arms straight back behind you, elongating through the arms. Be sure to do this exercise on both sides. Take the cables into the hands, anchor down onto your glide board, and come into a prone position for lat rows swimming. Extend the arms straight, sweep them down by your sides while adding a kicking motion. Elongate through the spine as your chest stays lifted into extension. Keep sweeping the arms straight behind to activate through the triceps while keeping the legs swimming throughout the entire exercise. Roll back into a supine position. Using your cables, start to alternate uppercuts aiming towards the same spot each time. For more core intensity, lift the legs to 90 while you crunch up and continue the uppercuts. For even more intensity, extend the legs straight. Keep the lower spine in contact with the glide board at all times. Come into a fighting stance. Do one plie, a crescent kick, then drop down into your plie again to do the crescent on the other side. This exercise alternates sides each time. Be sure to keep your arms up, your core engaged, and have full range of motion. For elephant, keep the upper spine rounded and the legs extended straight as you ride the glide board up and down the rails. Add a rear kick by leading with the heel and keeping the coordination of the opposite leg. Be sure to do this exercise on both sides. Come into a plank position with the legs extended, shoulders on top of wrist. Begin to bend the knees and extend them for modified plank tucks. Keep the upper body still while the knees bend and extend. For advanced plank tucks, come to your glide board with your hands on your foot bar. Keep your arms extended while the knees come in and extend straight back. Be sure to keep the spine long and the core engaged. Using the tower for balance, begin to do repeater side kicks. For more of a challenge, remove the arm, lead with the heel, and do this exercise on both sides. Good luck with week three's cardio kick and Pilates plan. I look forward to seeing you next week for the final workout series.